Hey y'all, it's Catherine with Cat's Keto Crew and Crazy Keto Cat and just wanted to hop on here and talk about do I really need exogenous ketones? <laughs> and my answer is going to be yes. But let me explain why. Okay, so it's 2018, right? Like we're living in 2018 and sure, we could walk everywhere, but isn't it easier to take a car? And you don't need Amazon, right? You could you could go to the store and go through all the aisles of stuff and you don't really need that protein shake, right? Like didn't Rocky eat raw eggs as a protein replacement? I don't know. Thinking last night, like, do I need my DVR? I could just be watching all these shows live and watching all the commercials. I don't know. It's twenty eighteen and I'm all about optimizing my experience, okay, and having the most optimized body that I can have. And that is where my ketones come in for me. So, first of all, there's numerous reasons why I take them, but I have been keto now for a year, and I do follow the keto diet. For so, for those of you who are like, but I follow the keto diet, I don't eat ketones, okay. I don't know about you, but like, real life happens, and... There are certain situations that I come in that sometimes I can't make the best food choices. Or I need what I like to call a little will powder in the form of a ketone to help with appetite suppression or help me make those better choices as I'm going about my day. Or it's holiday time, right? Like I need all the extra energy that I can get to tackle the lists of things that are long to do, like the grocery shopping and gift getting and all of these things. And when I start thinking about all of those things, in the past I would be so overwhelmed. Like, the holiday season is supposed to be about loving and thankful and giving and all of those great things, and yet sometimes we get so lost in all the things that have to be done or this, like, intense desire to make everything perfect. And I have been guilty of that in the past, and it would keep me up at night. Like, I would get into bed and lay there and be like, oh my gosh, I have this and that to do, and I need to do this tomorrow, and I need to talk to this person, and I should have done this, and I should have gone here, and oh my gosh, did I, you know, did I unplug the curling iron? Like, it just craziness. And these ketones have given me not only the energy to tackle the to-do list, but like that sense of calmness, that sense of I've got this, this internal like mood booster where that anxiousness isn't happening there, happening anymore. And I can sleep <laughs> at night, which is, which is always helpful too. But then I wake up feeling refreshed and have that energy and can tackle those to-do lists. And it does put me in just a better overall mood so I can enjoy spending time with my kids. And I can enjoy making the gingerbread houses or I can enjoy cooking some keto Thanksgiving treats. And, and that's just, that's a powerful thing for me. Um, and then, of course, there's, like, the fat loss that comes with the ketones, okay? So, not only do they help with fat loss, but they also help with skin. So, like, to have clearer skin and to be, have lost weight to the point where, like, I have to go buy new clothing for the holiday season, yeah, it's fun. It's fun to be able to go purchase new clothes. It's fun to not have to worry about, like, adult acne, which, like, I didn't even know that was a thing until I became an adult, and I was like, what is happening and I have found that with my continued use of ketones, that not only has my fat percentage in my body just completely changed, my whole body composition has changed. Like pants that used to be really tight or like loose to the point where a belt doesn't help, or like my overall skin, like I call it the keto glow. Like it's just, it's renewed, it's refreshed, and that feeling is not just on the outside, like it's inside. And... I feel like I can walk into a holiday party confident in myself, confident in my choices, and with a renewed sense of energy and pride and self-worth. And to think that that comes in a packet is kind of, it's kind of crazy. But the science is there, y'all. I don't know, many of you... I don't know if you're aware that I did get my PhD at Vanderbilt in molecular physiology and biophysics. Yep, that's a mouthful. But what I do know, and I will diagram out science for you all day long if you want, 
But I do know that these ketones are not a placebo. It is not just something that's in my head. It is scientifically working. And there are scientists and researchers and so many people learning about the full benefits of ketones. Like, for instance, Alzheimer's patients, okay? If you give them a huge amount of glucose or sugar, they show no, and they're measuring like brain activity, they don't show any increased brain activity with the delivery of glucose or sugar. If you give them a bolus or a boost of ketones, their brain lights up like a Christmas tree. And that's what those Alzheimer's patients need, okay? They need that brain to be active, to be working again, to, to be restored. And the possibility that this ketone could do that for someone is unbelievable. Um, and there's, I mean, there's years of research to come, but like, that's, that's an amazing thing. And the fact that like cancer patients, when they get diagnosed with cancer, this is often, this diet and these ketones are often recommended for people who are, who have cancer because tumors love sugar. Okay. So if you're trying to stop the growth of a tumor, if you take away its fuel source of sugar, so it's, it's exciting to see what science can do. It's exciting to see what science can do in my body. It is exci it's exciting to see what science can do to my mind. Um, and it's exciting to see what science will do for you. So I just wanted to share why I love my ketones. Um, and yeah, sure, there's other ways. I could be a very, very strict keto dieter every single day and count every single bit of what I take in and never, ever, ever, ever cheat. Well, wait, no, I can't do that. I'm human. So just wanted to share that with y'all today. It is a cold and rainy day here today, but um, I'm ready to light my brain up like a Christmas tree. So I'm going to probably go grab me some blue ocean. So chat with you later.